So Franklin St. Hex actually wants us to talk about something real quick. He's like, uh, let's talk about uni pump and why people think that they should have held instead of selling for Hex. And he's like, he's trying to explain to his friend mm -hmm. that the short term perspective is, is a wrong mentality. Mm -hmm. Right. And that's clearly correct, because I'm pretty sure somebody in math and Hex has probably made more during that time. Yeah, yeah, it's it's very close. I I have a friend who got the uni and only did a ten year stake and mm -hmm. immediately into hex and it's it's doing. I mean, I would say about the same, even, I think even without the interest. Yeah, but my, my man, it's, even, it's, it's, it's such a joke because even all that. They're not even looking at it properly because to make it a real investment uh, uh, yeah. differential, it, you go by based on one the person's stake, which means technically he stake for 10 years. And I promise you, and I would love for Uniswap to still be here 10 years from now. When we do the math, it's going to dwarf it by so much, it's not even funny. Yeah, exactly. Because, people just don't people, get it, man. People play, but, uh, and by the way, number one, you're right. But number two, people only play this narrative until the next palm shows up and then they're going to look like really stupid because what people don't understand and anybody that didn't understand this loud and clear, the secret move, which I did also right away, the secret move was locking in T-shares. That was a secret move. Hey, you, you got it at such a lower price in terms of T-share. And if you remember, and Wells can go back to the chart, there was a little bit of a dip. Okay. So multiple thing factors. You were buying it during the dip phase, and number two, go oh no, yeah, even here. You see that little W before? But no, go go one more up. Yeah, right here, right here. So it was a big dip, and the caviar, ha ha ha. It was before big payday. So you got even big payday bonus too. So it it, it, it doesn't even make sense. So make that very very clear. Big payday bonus plus interest accrued plus what it's going to do 10 years from now because of the share rate the person was able to get. Because let's not forget that during that time, you know, uh, 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 Hex per T share was about 11,000 and change, not 17,000 that it is now. So you don't even understand how valuable those T shares are. They're Genesis T shares. And you got big payday bonus on top of that. So it's just like it's a joke to even entertain. It's a waste of time. Pretty much. <laughs> like this, so, clip, I'm, can I'm, I might be able to get the actual number for you. Um, yeah, that's fine. Hope that you, know what you, can question, do? Uh, you know what you can do? You know what you can do also, Maddie? Let's keep tracking that year over year. We'll, we'll see how this age. Yeah, I mean, look, yeah. like, people <laughs> just don't get it. Like, this shit is isn't a protocol. Like, there's nothing to talk about. Like, it's just going to pay yeah. you. I want to make it. something very clear. The number one value is the solidification of the T-shirt creation at the time. Because you were winning on time. That's why I didn't even like waste the time. As soon as I realized what it was, somebody showed me how to claim it. I claim it, transfer, t shirt, done. Next day, I started, I was getting paid. Man, I wish, man. Mm -hmm. I wish I could go back in time so bad. You got no idea. <laughs> in the funny way, it's kind of the only, only uh, um, airdrop that I got. And that's cool because I didn't want to take any risks. I didn't want to connect Bro, what you mean? We get airdrops every day. <laughs> no, yeah, no, but, but, but yeah, in T-shirt, of course. No, what I mean by that, I'm well, joking, like, brother. I'm yeah. joking. No, what I'm trying to say is that, especially for the Dream account, I didn't want to take any risks. I didn't want to connect my wallet with some random stuff. It doesn't matter if you end up paying or whatever. Yeah, because, again, you I'm not out here chasing airdrops and shit either. Like it's cool if you're going, if you're strategically using exchanges. You know what I mean? Because you think there might you be airdrops. You should with your dream account, period, full stop. Yeah, you I mean, know, yeah, I don't, I'm not out there chasing uh -huh. airdrops, man. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm not. Like, it's cool if you think it's a, it's a, it's a good exchange and, mm -hmm. you know, if it's a, a decent exchange that you know people are using and yep. it seems to be safe. That's I want to be clear. I'm talking about right. the dream account. Don't, I know connect right. you know Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yep. So when I spoke about it, um, I don't know, like a week or two ago, it was it was about the same, but now Uni's pulled ahead a little bit because it's up for like four for four hundred Uni tokens, it's uh twelve thousand dollars, and for the hex stake, it's uh seven point nine k of free money, and yeah. uh, the number of T shares again. is a hundred and fourteen. Yeah, but again, you you're talking about That's it. Awesome. Then. Yeah, you're talking about it based on current price. We can change at any second. We can pump. Which, yeah, yeah. Right I now. mean, it's been. So all, I all mean, it was higher. Going. So yeah. it was a, it was 
a like around 11k back um another right thing before, right shares? before like at the beginning of february so like yeah, yeah. how many t-shirts did you say was the thing 114 114 t-shirts yeah hold on uh, uh, well do me a favor What's up? can you go to that other stream that shows the price of a t-shirt right now Ah, you want to go where the graphics yeah, or no, 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 on your on your chart, just go to ah, that chart. The chart. Yeah. yeah, quick math here right now, real quick. Uh, do you have you have a chart? Like 148. There yeah, you go, 148.22. All right, watch this, Maddie. 114 times 148.22, right? Value of the equipment. The t shirt is worth 16,897. End of story. Let's keep it moving. What? Nice. <laughs> oh, wait, what? <laughs> I didn't even hear that long time. Nobody's gonna come and tell me X, Y, Z. So I have to rewind the stream to see. Frankly, you got over. educate. Done. End of story. And this is based on today's price. If price goes up, yeah. Because again, again, very slow. Share rate went up almost 70%. And I'm not counting interest. I'm not even counting big pay. I'm just showing you the value of those t-shirts, which was created again, opportunity cost. It was created because you swap it then. If you had not done it then, this is what the price would have been. And this is how you calculate true valuation is the value of your equipment. That's so, it. So hold on. What was that number again, Kareem? Price, I'm sorry? What was that number again? Sorry. Very simple. Simple. 114, which is the number of t-shirts that Maddie gave me. Uh -huh. yes. The t-shirt price right now uh -huh. in dollar. That's the value of the equipment. That's the value of the money printer. <laughs> Exactly okay. how it works. And, and by the way, I, I think people need to understand that. And, and one more thing, one more thing. That's very fucking nice because Maddie only did a the friend only did a 10 year stake. I did five five five. Imagine five more years of interest at that share rate. It's not even it's not even a discussion, it's a waste of time. That's it. <laughs> but but for Franklin, because that's my boy, so he can tell the people now you're calculating it wrong. Income generating asset. That's the value you're tracking. Because again, you're not you cannot take away the stake anyway. Cause it's locked. It's the value of the equipment. That's the real opportunity cost. Because have you had not done it at that <laughs> point, you wouldn't have got that share rate. You wouldn't have got. You do the same money right now and trying to buy t-shirts. See how much you showed up. It's gonna be a fucking <laughs> joke. It's gonna be seventy percent less. So let me ask you guys a question. Yeah, take that thirty-four hundred dollar right now, whatever, and trying to buy t-shirts <laughs> with it. See how many you get, and then call. You'll be lucky. You'll be lucky if you get twenty. Let me ask you guys a question because I don't I don't know I wasn't around. Yeah, go ahead. Um, when was the Uni airdrop back in the day? Uh, right around that that place, like I showed you, like whenever that double uh, September, bottom. mid September, yeah, September. mid September. Oh, so this happened like right, like a couple months, like a few months right before, before Big, Big Fade. You see the W pattern before the yeah, run up. Yeah, Big yeah. Fade, that was then. So perfect double. He went, dude, he was all time low on the chart for Memi compared to before the pump and everything. right right this is literally you couldn't get it any better that's it crazy the the fucking i was there dude i had i was lucky because i had uh um two accounts that i got it for because it just i randomly wow. used another one because yeah. i wasn't looking for that and then and i helped my brother get his and my sister so they had it too and then literally it's like tack 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 call swap done keep it moving what let me look back yeah i've only gotten one i got the one inch that was it I don't know, I yeah, I got the uni swap, but because I had two account, I mean, some people got like eight, nine accounts. So, because yeah. I ended up, at the time I had two that I was using, so that's why I got it for because I swapped it over there too. So, and that's how it became like a popular thing, so whatever. But, but yeah, no, it makes sense. Like one of my other friends, he just consolidated all the other shit coin. It was a waste of time. Converted to ETH, push it over there, stake done. Like my other friend too, he had all this other stuff. We talking about Doge. I'm like, get the fuck out of here. No, we just move all the money. The 80K, boom, done. Create a stake. Boom. Day one, $100 a day. Let's go. That's it. It's, 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 it's simple. Again, don't complicate. Stop it's, looking at the bullshit so shiny simple. object. People don't it's realize so that simple. behavior is the fucking shining object. Before yep. you start complaining even about the hex based stuff, you should stop that kind of behavior because that's that's how you get wrecked. Because opportunity cost is against you when you're on a regular coin because you're waiting for fucking price to go up. That's Literally. why traders can be frustrated right now, but the true hexagons are chilling. Because every day, 7 p.m. Eastern time until a uh, month from now, we're getting fucking paid. That's it. That's it. Every day. End of story. Every day. Some serious money before price appreciation. Hmm. Get the money printers. Get them because they're they not free. 
And they only get more valuable every day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And as they get more valuable because they're yielding something that's becoming more valuable, their price will go up. Maddie, I can't wait after the next pump. We'll redo this math again on the 114 and then we'll see. We'll see yeah. where the swap is. Yeah. And then, and then we'll wait when the bear market comes. We'll also see where Uniswap is. All those people talking smack. We'll see. Yeah, so let me say this, guys. Just just to say this. Um, if you saw Uni at three, you know, for Hex, don't feel bad. Because the fact of the matter is <laughs> that that was the right long-term decision. Period. It was. I literally just did the math. It's more yeah. valuable. It's <laughs> like that was literally the right long-term decision. Dude, at period. that time, we were like near 0 0.002. And change, and this is, I mean, the one <laughs> I'm basing it on, yeah. the one I'm basing it on didn't happen until um, uh, 10 1, so that's October 1st. So there was like a week or two there where like the price of hex just ran up because everybody was converting from uni to hex. So, I mean, it would it would probably be even higher if you did it right away, like Richard yeah, said, which is what most people did. Yeah, we created yeah, that move up too because we bought that definitely. fucking dip like it was amazing, and then I was there. Saw it life it was amazing within two, three days, you know, because we communicated, and then soon after that, you know, the trader showed up for big payday trying to do their thing, right? And then by the time the second dip came in after big payday, that's when the other airdrop came in. I mean, man, X is just getting paid. It's just it's a no-brainer. Get you get your money printer. <laughs> Natty, this is a perfect example again, like I was talking about earlier about the DXY. All this shit is just narrative, it's just noise. And then when the bear market comes, all those people that were talking about, they're gonna just throw back to a, a hole somewhere and then like mm. so again, it's the same thing. Oh, yeah, but all these crypto fool rules would be disappearing soon. But but just for <laughs> the record, to be clear, if you calculate on the real value of T shares, it's actually still at this current price more valuable. Period, full stop. Let's keep it moving. And uh, keep in mind, that's a daily valuation, yeah. not annual. Mm -hmm. If the price change all of a sudden, boom. Yep. Because your money printer is like, again, know what you hold. You know, they call, we call it the diamond hands for a reason, right? You know what I mean? I, the diamond hands hold diamonds, baby. That's it.